In the Mix is presented by Bon Thai Restaurant and Lounge. Hoppin' everybody, I'm Sabrina Salas Matanani and welcome to another episode of In The Mix. She is a multiple world champion in wrestling, but she is also just as fierce in the cage and in the sport of MMA. She is Miyu Yamamoto. <laughs> Probably looking for the takedown. There it is right there. Boom! She gets the double, Joe. Double leg. That's what she was looking for. Wrestling is in Miyu Yamamoto's blood. My dad, um, he went to Olympics in 1972. And my brother started wrestling first. And then me and my sister kind of jump in. And then, yeah, we grew up in the wrestling mat. <laughs> and then, yeah, I started MMA two years ago. It's almost three years ago because my brother was fighter and yeah, so it's like a family business. <laughs> Miyu started wrestling when she was in the third grade. Growing up, she lived and breathed the sport. So how was it like, I mean, like at home growing up? I mean, were you guys, did you guys have a mat at home? Um, Actually we had, yeah. One time, yeah, uh, my, my dad brought Kind of, kind of like this, mm -hmm. like a gymnastic mat from um, his college, and then he put the mat on the, our, uh, our living room, mm -hmm. so, so we could get like, drills and stuff. And that wasn't fun, but I guess <laughs> that was a good for us. Yeah. Wait, it wasn't fun? It wasn't fun, yeah, because he he made us like, a drilling like after dinner, and then we just wanted to watch TV, but. Yeah, we do have a time to watch TV because of the wrestling practice. At what point did you know? Because um, you said 10, you were 10, and you said it wasn't fun, but at what point did it become fun for you? I'm mean, like, I'm going to treat this seriously. Oh, uh, you start um, like when we practice in like one new move, and then, you know, at the beginning I couldn't get it, and then I frustrated, it, and then I just want to, you know, go to my room, but start getting it, and then, um, improve at the, the competition, that'll be like, a, oh, you know, it's like, a, uh, I'm progressing. <laughs> Evidence of her progression turned into passion. In Japan, she won her first national title at the age of 13 and won seven more after that. She's a three-time world champion gold medalist in wrestling. On Mondays, she's here at Custom Fitness in Inigua, teaching wrestling at 11.30 a.m. to those willing to step on the mat, like myself. Yeah, oh, head inside, so wait, head inside, so this way. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Then yeah, I'm gonna step, and then you're gonna catch this one. And head up, head up, yeah, yeah. There you go. This one, and you're gonna pull, pull it back. Yeah, and yeah. <laughs> this is a practice that I do like a, more than like a million times to practice to get it, yeah. Of course. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Go so shoot. There you go. <laughs> Good job. Although she's not competing in wrestling currently, Miyu is an MMA fighter fighting with Ryzen, a Japanese mixed martial arts organization. She trains here on Guam. My brother brought me here because, yeah, he wanted to uh, move here and also he wanted me to train here. And then I wasn't sure because I didn't want to leave uh, my place because I, I thought I had a good training there. But I find out, oh my God, this is better. I'm having the best training camp ever. So. Even my yeah, brother gone, I stay here and have a friend here. Yeah. Who would you say is uh, your inspiration, your, your role model? It's my brother and my dad. Yeah. And my mom too, so yeah, it's my family. Can you tell me a Um, I guess I'm watching them every day, you know, um, what they do, like I have like a sacrifice to be a champ or to be winning victory. So I just 
always wanted to be, uh, you know, my brother or my dad. <laughs> yeah. Her brother is the legendary MMA fighter Nori Kid Yamamoto, who passed away earlier this year. Niyu steps into the ring later this month for Ryzen 14 to face her latest opponent, Mika Nagano. By the way, she's on the same card as boxing legend Floyd Mayweather. I'm going to have um, Ryzen 14 in Japan. It's in Tokyo, uh, December 31st. And it's going to be New Year's Eve, the biggest event. So I'm so excited. I'm gonna fight in. My son is gonna fight in the same car. So I heard. yeah, so so exciting. And then John Tuck, um, other the fighters are gonna be our corner. So yeah, we have really good team, a strong team. In the future, Miu is hoping to start a wrestling class for youth to get back to a sport that's given her so much. As for me, well, her class just set me up for a future challenge of my own. So, you know, I, I was on the mat today, and the champ is here, and he's agreed that we're going to do a challenge. We don't know what yet, but stay tuned for that in upcoming in the mix. I'm always up for a challenge. <laughs> stay tuned, and the mix returns in a moment.